Hey everybody, Dan here from Mandolins and Beer, and this episode we're going to be going over part two of the Grappelli Lick that we worked on the previous episode. We're going to be talking about Dan Patrick Amber Ale, and also I have got Mandolins and Beer stickers in. I uh, just got them in today, I'm super excited, and I got quite a few of them, so if you would like one, um, we could do it two different ways. You can email me at danielpatrickmusic at yahoo.com. And uh, I'll send you my address, and I will uh, have you send me a self-addressed stamped envelope, and then you can just mail that to me, and I will mail you a sticker. Or, even easier, PayPal. Um, 75 cents. You send me 75 cents. PayPal at DanielPatrickMusic at Yahoo.com. It'll be at the bottom of this video. I'll send you the sticker. I'll pay for the stamp and the uh, envelope, and we'll just eliminate the weight. So, without further ado... The Lick. The beer. This week's beer um, is... There's two reasons why I picked up this beer. Um, first reason is we share the name. Uh, I'm Daniel Patrick. Uh, this is Dan Patrick. And uh, to you, it's my favorite um, sports radio show slash television show uh, to, to watch and or listen to. And they have got their own beer from Red Hook called uh, the Dan Patrick Audible Ale. And uh, it's fantastic. Their little description here is fill your passion bucket with the ultimate crushable ale. Uh, it's smooth. It's tasty. Unlike the last couple. Um... It's only 4.7% alcohol by volume. This is a, uh, I think this beer, if I, uh, you know, I could be mistaken, but I'm guessing it's probably a good one to watch the game with if you like games. It's a great one to practice mandolin with. Uh, not nearly as potent. It's really, really smooth, refreshing, and uh, I really enjoyed it. So it is by Red Hook Audible Ale. I'm sure they have a website, probably redhook.com. I have not looked it up. Sorry, kind of in a hurry today to, to get through these. So check it out. Let's go to the breakdown. All right, the lick. Starts off like the one last week, last episode. Uh, it's going to have the little intro, which is just your F, G, F, B flat. So it's going to go. So after your intro, you're going to go back to the F, up to G sharp. to F. And if you're having a hard time following along, tab is available for free at the bottom of the video. Follow the link um, to the WordPress page or which is my blog, I guess. And um, you can also go to mandolinsandbeer.wordpress.com and the video and the tablature are there for free as well. So, sorry for that. I digress. So let's back to that. We're up to here so far. One, two, three. And we're going to add a couple more F notes. Go back up to our B flat. Go to C, C sharp, back to C, down to the lower octave B flat. B flat. So so far, here's where we're at. One, two, three. Three quarters of the way there. And then it ends with a G, an open D, an E, second fret of the D, the D string, back to an open D, C on your G string, and then B flat, and play a B flat chord. So again, the key to this is swinging it. You don't want to have straight, boring, you know, that's not how the lick goes, but it's boring. It's it's stiff feeling and disjointed. And for the, uh, for the Grappelli kind of thing, you need the feel, the swing feel. So let's run through this entire lick one time here slowly. Yeah. 
that's it. So add that one to last week's lick. You got a uh, fun little uh, fun little thing to throw into your next jam session, especially if you're playing the key of B flat. Transpose it, move it around. Um, don't forget, please, mandolins and beer stickers. They're free. Um, I get, they're 75 cents, but that's really for the stamp in the envelope. Uh, or you can send me a self-addressed stamp envelope, and I'll send you one for free. So however you want to do it, regardless, uh, thanks a lot. Facebook page, please go to it and like it. Please, if you're watching this video, right below it, subscribe. Help me get to a uh, uh, higher subscriber rate. I'd like to get to 100. I'm almost there. So let's do that this week, and we'll be back with another lesson soon. Cheers.